Well, folks, we did it. The kids are out of the house. The career is over, and now it's time to settle down in a nice, affordable town to ride off into the sunset. As a freshly minted retiree, I set out on a mission to uncover the best bang-for-your-buck towns across this great nation of ours. I scoured real estate listings, crunched the numbers, and evaluated amenities. The results may surprise you. Turns out you don't need six figures in the bank to live like royalty in retirement if you pick the right zip code. In this video, I'll walk you through the most budget-friendly options that still offer big-time lifestyle perks. We're talking low cost of living, but high quality of life. So grab your sun hat and sunglasses, and let's explore the top bargain paradises for living your best retired life on a modest nest egg. After paying your dues for 40 odd years, don't you think you've earned an affordable place in the sun? Unfortunately for us retirees, affordable and desirable don't always go hand in hand. But if you're willing to venture off the beaten path, there are still a few gems to be found. Listen, I'm not getting any younger and my knees sure don't work like they used to. After 30 years of teaching ungrateful teens, I'm ready to trade in my chalkboard for a rocking chair, but I'm no fool. I've done my research. These towns aren't just cheap. They've got everything a guy like me needs to live out my golden years in comfort. The way I see it, any of these towns would suit me just fine. Decent weather, low cost of living, and plenty of other retirees around for company. What more do you need when you're over the hill? The future's looking bright and affordable too. My teaching days might be done, but with places like this, retirement's going to be a breeze. Take Sierra Vista, Arizona, for example, with a low cost of living and high quality of life. With rent under $1,000 a month and houses for under 250 k Sierra Vista won't break the bank. Yet somehow, it still manages a livability score of 79. Must be the warm weather, proximity to Mexico for cheap health care, and crime rates well below the national average. Sure, the summer heat will melt your dentures, but the winter weather is perfect for my rheumatism. And at under $1,000 a month for a place to live, I'll have plenty of cash left over for the slots. The huge retiree population means I'll have no trouble finding a pinochle partner. Plus, it's only an hour to Mexico for discount prescription drugs and dental work. What more could I ask for? Or how about Pueblo, Colorado? This town is beauty on a budget. Pueblo offers the best of the West at a discount. Majestic Rocky Mountain views? Check. Craft breweries and wineries? Double check. A quaint downtown and outdoor recreation galore? Check and check. Despite higher than average crime, Pueblo's low cost of living and natural charm still make it appealing. Pueblo, Colorado has the Rocky Mountains in view and clean air to fill my smoker's lungs. The 150K houses may need some work, but I've still got a few good years of DIY left in me. And Pueblo West sounds ideal if I want to buy a plot of land. I've always wanted to try my hand at alpaca ranching. Sure, the crime rate's a bit high, but at my age, I don't have much worth stealing anyway. Can't choose between mountains and desert? No need to in Montrose, Colorado. The best of both worlds. Nestled in the picturesque Uncompagre Valley, Montrose offers mild weather, clean air and water, and easy access to surrounding wilderness areas. While a bit pricier than other towns on this list, at $1,643 a month, Montrose's natural beauty and small town vibe are hard to beat. An ideal combination for retirees seeking natural splendor on a budget. In New Mexico, Truth or Consequences, the town formerly known as Hot Springs, spoke to me. Eccentric name aside, T or C offers hot springs, cheap rent, and a funky art scene. My inner hippie perked right up. The $1,400 average monthly spend wouldn't break the bank, and I like the idea of being a big fish in a little pond. While not everyone's cup of tea, spots like Sierra Vista and Truth or Consequences give you a chance to live large on little in retirement. No butlers or golf courses, but for me, low key and affordable beats cushy any day. The open road still calls, and in places like these, adventure awaits around every corner. My nest egg may not go far, but in the right small town, I'll stretch each dollar and make unforgettable memories. Retirement, here I come. Now let's get into frequently asked questions on planning your retirement and the best places to retire in America. Why uproot your life to retire somewhere new? Listen, I get it. You've lived in the same place for decades, raised a family there, have lifelong friends nearby. Why leave all that behind just to retire? Here's the deal. Your fixed income may not stretch as far as you'd like in your current hometown. Property taxes and healthcare costs keep rising while your social security check stays the same. Do you really want to spend your golden years pinching pennies? What's so great about these affordable retirement towns anyway? 
I'm not saying you have to move to a retirement community in Florida or Arizona to live out your days playing shuffleboard and bingo. No offense to shuffleboard and bingo fans, the towns on this list have a low cost of living, but also natural beauty, culture, outdoor recreation, and vibrant downtowns. Many are college towns, so you'll find energetic cafes, live music venues, and lifelong learning opportunities. How much moolah do I need to retire there? The good news is, in these affordable retirement havens, your fixed income will stretch comfortably. Housing costs are well below the national average. My research shows you can rent a nice one-bedroom apartment for under $700 a month or buy a livable home for under $150,000. Your total monthly expenses should come in around $1,500 to $1,700, leaving a bit left over for hobbies, healthcare, and the occasional night out. Not too shabby. The bottom line? Don't dismiss the idea of retiring in a new, more budget-friendly town. You've spent decades working hard and paying your dues. Now is the time to enjoy life with financial freedom and peace of mind. A fresh start in an affordable community could be just the ticket. What are you waiting for? Adventure awaits. Well, there you have it, folks. The best of the best for stretching those retirement dollars. I don't know about you, but after reviewing this list, I'm feeling pretty confident. I can make my golden years really sparkle on a modest budget. The only question left is, do I want hills or beaches, rivers or lakes, forests or deserts? Decisions, decisions. Hopefully this video has given you some food for thought and maybe even helped narrow down your options. Just don't forget the sunscreen if you do choose to head south or west. And be sure to wave hello if you see me shuffling along Main Street in my new hometown. Happy trails and penny pinching.